Hi, I'm Janine Kitzmiller from Kitzmiller RV, and today we're talking about sidewall maintenance. Um, one of the things that you want to do before you go on a long trip, or when you get your unit out of storage, or if you've parked it for a while, something like that, is, is actually check the sidewall um, and tread before you travel. One of the ways that we'll just check sidewalls to see if you can get your fingers in there. That's a pretty good indication. If you can't get your fingers in there, you probably need new tires. Um, I'm not going to talk about tread depth. That's something you want to talk to a tire guy about for sure. But you want to do a physical inspection to make sure that there aren't any grooves, um, divots, like maybe if you've run over something in the road, you're going to feel that on the tread. On the sidewalls, it's a little bit harder to check. The dry rotting that you're going to get really doesn't show up very well to the naked eye, but it's one of the things that will really surprise you on the side of the road after you've gotten them hot. Um, this particular tire is only about two years old. It only has maybe 2,000 miles on it, but because they've left this unit parked probably against a barn on the other side, we've gotten a lot of UV ray damage on this side of the unit. There's actually some cracks in here that are difficult to see to the naked eye, and I like to use like a chalky substance. Um, one of the things that I have at home is baby powder, and you know it's relatively inexpensive to do a sidewall check with baby powder. When you rub this on the tire, dry tire please, this will actually land in the cracks and light up for you. One of the places that it's showing up is right in here. So we have some hairline cracks standing on end here. And then down here, there's actually a large gash that the baby powder is settling in right here. And that's probably from an impact wound. But all of this cracking, the baby powder is sticking in these areas. And if it sticks to any degree, then it's time to do something with the UV ray damage. And you really can't repair a sidewall. You have to change the tire. Thank you for watching another Open Road Show webisode brought to you by Kitzmiller RV. Remember, if you have any other questions, you can reach us at the Contact Us button at kitzmillerrv.com. Miller RV